Hi, boys and girls. It's Mrs. Miller here again today. We're going to start with sight words. The first thing we're going to do is go through all of them. So let's go through all of our words. Here we go. Was, ate, good, could, said, then, into, your, find, on, whoops, but, came, this, a, how, come, like, me, my, with, see, you're doing great, what, now, the, to, I, we, of, many, where, is, who, so, will, be, go, here, soon, up, for, that, from, are, you, and, they, new, say, give, them, play, make. All right, boys and girls, that's a lot of words. Look at that pile of words. Make sure that you're practicing those words. It doesn't take you long to go through all of your sight words. So make sure that you're going through all of those sight words a lot during the day, okay? Or every day, at least making sure you're going through every single day. Um, you have a sight word page to do for me today. So it's this one. This is kind of a new one. So you're going to find the word good inside of here. And then you're going to circle it. And then you have to write it over here. So you have to have the box that goes down, two normal boxes, and then the box that goes up. This might be a little tricky for you the first time you do it. So you might need some help. Okay, so you've got to find the word over here and then find which box it goes in on this side. So again, it might be a little tricky. You might need some help the, um, with, with that page, okay? So make sure if you need some help that you ask someone to help you with that. All right, so um, we're going to blend some words together for me. Let's do the word miss. Ma, I, s, miss. Pat, p, at, pat. Mud, m, ud, mud. Den, d, n, den. Hot, h, ot, hot. Wig, w, ig, wig. Good job. All right, and now we're going to listen for how many sounds we hear. So how many taps? Thin. In, that was three, good. Job, j, ob, good. That was three again. R, an, ran, good. Three again. Hog, h, og, we did three taps. Let, l, et, also did three taps. So just thinking about how many taps. How many taps is how many letters you write down when you're working. All right, and then we worked on this a little bit yesterday. We're going to do a few more of these today. So we have the word mix. Okay, we're going to take the m away and put s. Now we have six. Mix six. All right, now we have the word hop. Okay, hop. We're going to take the h away and put m. Now we have mop. Good. We went from hop to mop. 
Great job. So those are difficult, but I know that we'll continue to work on those and we'll get better and better at those. So great job on that, boys and girls. Thank you for sticking with me today through those. All right. The next thing that we are going to do is look at our next story. I do want you to remember a couple of things. Number one, working on those sight words. You can write them. You can use those cards and hide them around the um, around your house. You can tape them onto things if it's okay with your parents. Um, you could get a box and put some salt in them and you could write the words in salt. You could use your Play-Doh and roll the letters. All of those are great things to practice your sight words. Not only are you practicing your sight words, but I want you making sure that you're reading every single day. If you got the bag from your teacher with books in it, I want you to make sure that you're reading those, at least one book every single day, okay? And if you have books at home that you like to read, that's great too, or books at home that are a little hard for you and you want to pick out the sight words, but I want you working on that because reading is a very important skill that we need to be working on in kindergarten. So today we're going to read the story, How to Be. And we're going to think about how the set, the text, how the words match the pictures as we go through here. How to be a bear. Now, we might not know that this is the word. Goodness, that's really hard to see. We might not know that this is a uh, the word bear, but we could see that the picture and the words match. Catch fish with your hands, hibernate. Again, thinking about sleeping is called hibernate. Growl, look, we can tell that she's growl. Okay, so the words and the pictures are matching. Be brave, she's about to jump. How to be a monkey, if you see there's a monkey on that book. So monkey and monkey match. Swing from a tree. And thinking about that picture matches our words. Eat with your toes. Copy someone. Because that's what monkeys do. They copy each other. Be curious. How to be a, what do you think? Turtle. Good job. Bask in the sun. It's like lay in the sun. Hide. Move very slowly, because that's what turtles do. Be patient. How to be a snake. Good. Shed your skin. Slither. Dance in a basket. Look, the words and the picture match. He's dancing in a basket. Be charming. How to be a spider. Creep along walls. Wait for a meal to come to you. Build a web. Notice the picture and the words match. Be creative. How to be a dog. Good job. Fetch. Beg for food. Lick someone. Be friendly. How to be a person. Be brave, curious, patient. Ooh, some of us don't have that. Charming, creative, and friendly. Be yourself. So again, thinking about being you. All the animals in there were being themselves as you should also be yourself. So today I just wanted to share that with you and always just make sure that you're remembering to be you. You are someone special and everybody loves you and the special person that you are. All right, boys and girls, have a great day and a wonderful weekend and I'll see you again next week. Bye-bye.